beautiful people and welcome back to our channel it has been reported that sunday igweho has been arrested by uh, monday night after fleeing nigeria to evade and uh, was arrested by the secret police in kotonu as he was trying to travel to another country and taking the road from kotonu one of the council to the yoruba freedom fighter sunday adeyemo known as sunday igweho who was arrested in kotonu bini republic Pelumi Ola Jengwesi has stated that the activist surrendered himself and was not captured by the security operative. If you are yet to subscribe to our channel, we say we will urge you to kindly please click on the red subscribe button below and most importantly the notification bell beside it to always get the latest news here on our platform. Sunday Igboho had been arrested on Monday night in Kotonu as source noted that he was heading for Germany. He was however nabbed by security operative in the neighboring country. Speaking with the Sahara report on Tuesday morning, Ola Jengbesi said, Truly, he was arrested and I have confirmed that. We are making effort to ensure that he is fine. You know the Department of State Service declare him wanted. And also, it was put on the stop list as they actually give a, a recommendation and also a warrant that he should be arrested at any point wherever he's been seen in every airport, respectively. As I said, he is someone who believes that the Yoruba people in Nigeria generally should live in peace wherever they are. As a matter of fact, he said, Let me tell you now that Sunday Igboho was arrested simply because he wanted to make himself available to the government. If not, Sunday Igboho is not someone who can be arrested that way, but because he believes that the journey to justice for the Yoruba people and for the Nigerian state to be able to live in peace may be needed for him to be available, and that was why. The source privy to the incident had said Sunday Igboho had been arrested in Kotonou and he was arrested about an hour ago. He was supposed to travel to Germany through Kotonou this night and he wanted to leave Africa through Kotonou. He was arrested by security operatives in Kotonou as they are planning to bring him back to Nigeria. And to recall that the Department of the State Service had declared Igboho wanted after its operative carried out a bloody midnight raid on this incident in the Soka area of Ibadan, Oyo State. The DSS Public Relations Officer Peter Afnaya had advised Igboho to turn himself in to the nearest security, and those cheering and elogizing him may appeal to or advise him to do the needful, Afnaya said and he should surrender himself to the appropriate authorities he or anyone can never be above the, uh, the law and also regarding this previously it was been said that there was been there has been a letter that has been sent that actually guaranteed that the government has made him wanted by the dss as well and also giving every security department the authority to arrest him in every way he was, he, has, he was seen as it was being said that his whereabouts wasn't known as that previously previous weeks ago but now uh, regarding the what the person who said as the this Allah Jane basically said that he actually stunned himself in not because he can't he can't flee or can't get himself a better place to stay and keep low profile but he actually believed that there is a need for, for peace to reign in the country as that is what he actually stands for creating peace and also making yoruba people have a say in the country called nigeria also in a previous report after the raid on Igbo's house it was being said that Sunday Igboho was arrested and also after the arrest as they claim to have said that he was hiding at the Guru Maharaj's temple and also the national embattled um, agitator Sunday Adeyemo Sunday Igboho came out to debunk the news of his arrest as at the previous reading and also Sunday Igboho in which his house was invaded 
and also he escaped the invasion although two persons were killed and 13 persons were arrested and paraded by the department of state service in abuja and but late on the on the sun on the night in the night an online medium had reported that Igbo was arrested by the dss at the sad guru maraji camp and had been taken to abuja but Igbo's aide, as well as those close to Guru Maraji, told newsmen in separate interviews that the story was not true. And Igbo also debunked his rumor, arrest in a recorded voice message played on Facebook by his media aide online Yomi Koiki during a live show at about 11.59 pm. Igbo, who spoke in Yoruba language, said he was still at his house in Ibadan. And he said, Good evening, my fans. I thank you all. My name is Sunday Go, and today is July 2nd, 2021. I have been hearing that they have arrested me at Guru Maharaji. It is a lie. I was not at Guru Maharaji. I am in my house in Ibadan, and nobody arrested me. Meanwhile, one of Igbo's maternal uncle, simply identified as Afa, was said to be one of those killed during the invasion of his residence at, by the DSS operatives. And as well, regarding that, the Yoruba nation activist was said to have escaped all manners of threat and also ability to arrest him not until recently in which was being reported that he actually turned himself in as it was being reported that it was not like the government actually had the ability and the capacity to arrest him but he made sure that he turned himself in as there has been a lot of reactions and um, reactions and pouring out of mind regarding this in which was said that the government were able to arrest and to take in Sunday Igbo as they have done for Kano in Amde Kano as well. And also following the reaction of people, they were so disappointed that someone trying to get a peace to reign in the country was actually taken in. And that those people, the Fulani Earthmen in which are killing a lot of people in the country, they failed to find solution to that as the killing banditry and also the Fulani killing was so brutal that they are they find nothing to do to hate and it is getting too much. But someone who is willing to actually to make peace reign and to de to destroy every act of evil in the country was said to be trying to break the country into pieces by fighting for the Yoruba nation and making Yoruba nation to be separated from the old Nigerian as well. Alright guys, if you are yet to subscribe to our channel, don't forget to click on the red subscribe button below and most importantly the notification bell beside it to always get the latest news here on our platform and also to be updated anytime a new viral news is being dropped here on our platform. Thank you so much and God bless you.